Thank you. Uh, uh, Shantaram, you can speak five minutes. Okay. okay. Sir, the payment of wages, amendment eh? bill. Ah. <laughs> you see, already you have taken extra 19 minutes. It's a bill of regarding wages, yeah. regarding payment, five minutes. regarding cashless payment. But it, it covers a wider ambit. Okay. And therefore it starts from, the ambit starts from 8th November, according to me. Although the government says the process of demonetization had started two months prior to that. Two months prior to 8th November. But nobody was told. And even RBI took a decision on 8th November at 5 p.m. I don't know when the report was submitted to the cabinet. Are for a wrong on the bill. Uh, yes, yes. <laughs> I am saying, sir. See, yeah. question is, uh, therefore I am saying, I began by saying it refers to wages, but it is cashless economy, which is therefore takes us to demonetization. That is, and in fact, in fact, after demolition, all the time PM was talking about cashless economy only. He forgot about demolition. And he was speaking about cashless. Everybody should pay by cashless methods. Therefore, I, this is a subject which is of wide ambit. That's why I'm saying it. So, now payment will be by wages, according to PM. But therefore, I'm saying, no, no, no more. when this process no, no. started, this process started on 8th November or officially prior the last to that, week unofficially, no. two months prior to that. And when, to my question yesterday, a star question, finance minister reply, whole thing, supplementaries, both things were covered in two minutes. It has never happened, such a question of such a magnitude was covered by finance minister in two minutes. Then, three, four more supplementaries, one, one minute each. Why the government is treating this aspect of economy in such a casual manner? And therefore, this bill also will be treated in a casual manner, according to me, unless you are serious about cashless economy. In, in, in your own state, Goa, which is administered by BJP, what you did about this thing? You announced the government, BJP government announced in Goa, this is the first state which is going cashless. It was a front page news in many papers. And thereafter, BJP workers themselves, they had to meet, pass a resolution, and request their own government to withdraw that notification regarding cashless economy. Beg your pardon? No, no, you... You only five minutes, so you... I am, I am pointing out that BJP government workers have to meet and request their own government to withdraw the notification regarding cashless economy. This is how you began with the cashless. No. <clears throat> Secondly, question is, we wanted to know, we wanted to know, because what was to be told to us by the Prime Minister, who assumed the role of Finance Minister, as to how the process started, whether a letter, letter was written under Section 7 by the Government of India to the RBI, or RBI, so motto, took a resolution under 26.2, which we were entitled to know, which, which we were entitled to know. This is a part, this aspect is a part of this bill. Do, if, if you are saying that, you are transgressing. You are going astray from what I am saying. They are all questions related. Therefore, we wanted to know whether Section 7 was adopted or 26.2 was adopted. Secondly, <coughs> after this cashless economy came into force, everything you say, fine. Country a chitter ray, kya figures are a go today. I got an uh, unstar question, and figure was that in Goa 
the tourist inflow has increased. This is a blunder. This is the reply I got that tourist inflow in Goa increased after demonetization. Whereas everybody knows that most of the hotels that 20 to 30 percent occupancies. And hotel owners told me that this is the case with every hotel. See, if, if there was inflow of tourists in Goa, why the percentage uh, decreased? And why the reply is different in, in, given in Parliament? Therefore, I, I don't think you should uh, take the matter seriously with respect to, okay. but not play with this. I'll take one more okay. minute, sir. No, please. I was talking about unemployment. Unemployment. How much unemployment has been created after this demonstration? How much? How much people have been retrenched, layoffs, dismissed? Can anybody give figures? MOS finance is not there. I, I don't know. MOS Sitaramji thinks ministries are linked. You should also know those figures. Labor ministry is because dealing with one aspect, but you are dealing a lot of many aspects. Start off, okay. make in India, everything is with you. So therefore, these figures of layoffs, dismissal should be with you, and and you must okay. acquaint us with those figures. Secondly, okay. everybody knows last point. Everybody knows what was the fate of contract laborers. They did not wait. The employer did not wait even for seven days. All of them were asked to go home. We'll call if you are needed. And thousands and thousands of workers lost their job in first 15 days. In first 15 days. Okay. 15 days. Lakhs of people were retrained will lost job. Today, Prime Minister has sakta hai. Hamari maja kuda sakta hai. Kyunki figures unke paas hai. Jo figures ho batayenge, wo hamin sunna padega. Okay. So, aap sochiye, is bill ka chanchas upyok kiji. Bas. Okay, thank you.